My name is Eric Almeida and I am the department chair for the Automotive Technology Program. One of the main reasons for wanting our students to have internships is to give them a, a dose of reality. What's it going to be like when they hit the shop floor? My name is Lance Mitchell and I am the service manager here at Mercedes-Benz of Shrewsbury. My name is Jason Panon and I'm in auto tech at Mount Wachusett Community College. I set lifts on the cars and do minor things that are asked of me like changing oil, changing tires, changing fuel filters, maybe do cleanup, everything like that. Jason has been on board for about six months and we're very impressed with him as a human being, a citizen, as well as a, an employee. He's a great young man. His mentor, after a couple weeks, said, I've already hired him to come on full-time when he graduates in May. They want to smile for me, buddy. You better give it to him. Working with the right? people at Wagner, it's been really, really good. They have no problems with me leaving early or coming in late because I have class. Five stars, 10 out of 10 for everyone here because they make me love this job or internship. One of the things about Jason that I think has made him as successful as he is, is his want or his desire to learn new information. He looks deeper than just the repair, he looks into the cause, and that's what makes a great tech. Yep, that goes in the middle and actually holds the, the shaft for the uh, alternator and then you take another special. I talked to the other technicians here and how they went to the bigger colleges and that it was more of kind of an assembly line feeling versus MWCC's course where I feel like that you have fellow classmates help you, you have the teacher help you. The experiences that you get from just having that smaller group or smaller one-on-one -on -one feel, I feel like it definitely helps because you learn a lot more. I think that the program there at MWCC is one of the best in terms of the students' needs because without all of the people that have helped me along the way at MWCC, I probably would never be where I would be today.